Hi and welcome to Aquatic Mike. Today I'm bringing you another Fry development video. This time around we'll be having a look at Cordura CW10. This fish is also known in the trade as Cordura's Gold Laser or Gold Laser Cordura's. This fish originates from Peru from what I've been able to find out on the internet somewhere in the vicinity of Pucallpa uh, I don't know whether if it's from the Yucali river that's over there but uh, other species of fish from around that vicinity are couple of ancestral species for example some panaculos some anostomus there is also some tura kukarax or giant hatchet fish and also some apistogramoides uh, I'm sure there are other species of fish as well but uh, since I'm not sure whether if they're actually from the Yukali River I uh, don't want to put them in print in the video <clears throat> here we got the fries at seven days old so you can see they're very similar to Cordura CW 9 and 23 while at uh, this age they're filmed in a 12 liter tank uh, and uh, throughout this video they're kept in the same tank uh, until the adults are shown towards the end so it's the same lightning here they are one month you can start seeing their gold bar slightly and this the odd fry that hasn't grown as quickly as the rest but the majority of them are round about the same size they've been fed uh, microworms and gel food homemade gel food throughout their growth up until two months of age and there's just a double sponge filter in here as well and some uh, on snail and throughout the fries um, development I only measured them at one stage and it was at the one month marker and they were 1.6 centimeter standard length so without the uh, cordial fin or the tail fin and 1.9 with the fin included 1.9 centimeter in total length and here are the fries at two months of age and as you can see now they're starting to look like their parents with a lot of gold and the gold arc is starting to show even more within the fry And one who has gotten ahead of the others who's a bit larger quite possibly a female I didn't well uh, check whether if that was true later on however and since they're slightly shy I thought I'd uh, drop them some food so they uh, come out and show themselves a little bit more so here is some food going into the tank small small particles only just to get them swimming around a little bit more and uh, this fish belongs to lineage 7 just like uh, Cordura CW9 Cordura CW23 do as well and also the regular 
Corridora Cyanus or uh, the metal um, Corridoras or it's at least what we call it in Sweden suppose it's called bronze Corridoras or something in English within the trade at least but yeah they're rather active most of them are feeding rather well and at around about uh, this size I normally move them however as you can see slightly in the background there's one or two fry that are slightly smaller than the rest of them so if I've got several batches of fry going like some in other tanks I may put them within some uh, within one of the other tanks with some smaller fry to give them a better chance of uh, catching up and eating so they don't go get out competed here we've got the tank with the, the adults these are their parents they're well caught and uh, this tanks just got a sponge filter and uh, you can't see it in the video but there's also a mangrove root and some plants in here I believe Ceratopteris is one of the plants at least and uh, well I guess this rounds this video up thank you for watching please like subscribe share and comment take care